Hey guys, it's August 2nd. I really didn't record anything yesterday. I worked a 12 hour a day. I just got off not long ago. But to go do laundry. Try to cash in a couple birthday freebies. Because <laughs> my birthday's tomorrow. So, you guys know I sign up for all the like different coupons and stuff. So, we have free meals for a little bit. <laughs> uh, oh, and coworker. Of mine got me a few little things. His little cat ears. And these nail polishes. Oh, my camera does not want to focus. Nail polish. I need nail colors. And scrunchies. Stopped by all these while I'm waiting for clothes to wash, and I got another thing of these plant steps because I like them. So, I'll mess with that later or tomorrow. This bird just flew into the window. He's kind of stunned or dead. He's playing VR. I got all y'all B. <laughs> Actually, I don't, I don't know if I got Scorpion B, but I got, I got both of you B. Guys, it's August 3rd, and I'm waiting for my boyfriend to get out of the survey place right now. We went, we're doing a taste test that's today and tomorrow, and we'll each get $40 for it. I finished mine first, though. It's also my birthday. I got my free Starbucks earlier, and I'll probably cash in on some other free food. Just waiting for my BF to get out. Hey guys, I'm driving to drop off a package. They go me cashing in free bays, running errands. I work tonight, so I'll, I'll end up going to bed soon enough. Anyway, I took a little nap earlier before we went to the survey place. It's a good thing we got that survey schedule because I'll definitely need that forty dollars. We were supposed to get our referral bonus. Like I was supposed to get my reference bonus this last check. And my boyfriend was supposed to get his 30-day uh, bonus, but no, the company screwed up. So I don't know. I mean, they should give it to us this week, but there's no guarantee. It probably won't happen until next check. And I was kind of expecting that money, so I mean, not like. Short or anything, it's just tight, you know. That's what it is. I had money for the bills, I had money to get groceries and all that. I just, I like having a little more wiggle room, so that extra 40 will be nice. finished our taste test survey, got our $40 check for that. Um, I made some cookies for my boyfriend. See one more peanut butter cookies and well, my co-workers gave me a shit ton of peanut butter. The one who bought my peanut butter cookies before, she gave me a shit ton of peanut butter and all. I was like, ah, Jesus. Just got rid of all this peanut butter because I had too much. Now you gotta give me more. So that and um er, my brain I'm going to get I need to get some larger drill bits because I'm uh need them for a little project so I got my uh birthday freebie from Ulta 
I wanted the Clinique eyeliner, but they didn't have it. They only had this um, facial cleanser, so. You're so sweet. You're so sweet. It's your baby. Hey guys, it's August 5th and I'm got off work not too long ago. I edited video together and I'm gonna go get breakfast because I have a free pancake thing from uh, IHOP so might as well right get some free breakfast all the cash on my birthday freebies it's gonna be like a couple week affair I got a free burrito yesterday and I got free slushies for me and my boyfriend but like oh, I already had a coupon but then uh, they were backed up and shorthanded so the guy just gave them to me free anyway and I was like okay I could use this coupon another time Woo. I can't finish this it's too sweet I'm on the hunt for gypsum and I said it's somewhere down here uh-huh well pelletized gypsum. I think I want powdered gypsum. Hmm. Hey guys, it's August 6th in Deal Work Drama when I'm already home. Isn't that right, Doogie? It's alright. I say bacon, bacon, bacon. Making breakfast. Doogie! You poor starving child! You poor starving child! Those little haunches on your back. You won't survive the winter. <laughs> you poor starving kids. You know you have food. You have food over there. Ooh, perfect eggs this time. Look at that. Beautimous. Bacon egg and a little bit of cheese and pepper. Yeah. Making peanut butter fudge for the first time. This looks like weird soup. So I forgot to show me finishing up, but it's cooling in here. I wrapped it in this parchment paper. So it's easy to cut up later. Look at the big bunny. Hey there, little guy. Or girl. Hey there, little thing. You're so tiny and cute. It's okay. I'm not gonna hurt you. You can see your little baby so scared. It's okay. Okay, I'll let you do your thing. Hair dyeing is in progress. I finished up uh, a bottle of purple. I have uh, about half one. Should be enough for my head for this round. I need to get some more of this lavender though. Um, of course I'm staining everything in the process as usual. I got this on my head. I'm gonna be. Let's try to separate the pink part as much as I can from the purple except for like where it starts to blend in the best that I can so I'm gonna have this set in my hair for at least a few hours and I'm gonna even get a little heat blast with the old uh, hair dryer have my freaking bonnet on just to keep everything contained while I let it sit Ding. So, you know, styling. 
Hey guys, it's August 8th. I totally forgot to show my hair after I washed it yesterday. Unfortunately, a lot of the purple didn't stick as well as it usually does. I just think that's because, unfortunately, the bleach, when I had it in there, didn't get it light enough. It was still too yellow. And it definitely toned me more pink than anything. Sorry, my boyfriend was hollering at me from the other room, but yeah my my purple didn't quite turn out the way i wanted it to unfortunately and that was all the purple i had left like on the under part i don't know i was a little disappointed i guess when the purple starts to fade out i'll just do blue fuck it because that's what I have outside of pink now. Like, my pink always comes up because I have, like, figured out the pinks that actually work for my hair. But I even separated it, so I don't know why so much pink is up here. I'm confused. <laughs> hey guys, it's hot as shit. <laughs> I'm, uh, I had a free thing for Baja Blast freeze with a purchase so I got like a dollar burrito I tried going to Sonic and it was a clusterfuck so I just left I was like because I had some a free side but it's like nobody would fucking respond to me and then my app wasn't working right saying that my location wasn't taking my mobile order and it's like I was gonna ask them on the intercom what was going on but I couldn't get anyone to respond, and I waited there like 10 minutes, and I'm like, fuck this. But you know what's funny? So I worked at Taco Bell for a long fucking time. I worked there almost four years. And we had the Baja freezes the whole time. I never drank one the whole time I was working there. Like, I think they got those maybe a couple years after I started. I used to love the strawberry, like the OG strawberry freeze. I miss those. They have the actual strawberries on top. I was sad when they got rid of those. But yeah. Hot as fuck. So this works. And I'm about to grab a couple things from Aldi. Trying to make some jewelry stuff. Yeah. Trying to make some jewelry stuff. I gotta drill holes in this with this hand drill. Definitely takes a little hand muscle, especially my carpal tunnel. Hey guys, August 8th. Um, I'm fucking tired, man. I got off work. Work was a fucking. It's like the last couple hours of my shift, things just wanted to start not working right, our camera system. Then after I left, apparently everything just stopped working in one of the buildings, the internet. My uh, fellow supervisor couldn't log on to anything. She's calling me off and on just to give me updates on stuff. Because she was getting frustrated and she wanted to vent. It's one of those days. And I spent a few hours editing a video together. And trying to wind down a little bit. Finish a couple of things. And I'm just going to sleep again. Because I'm still so fucking tired. Even though I slept. So yesterday. Well, Friday night into Saturday morning. So I went to bed at like 8 Friday night. <clears throat> and I got out of bed yesterday at 10, but I did wake up a couple times, but my Fitbit said I got about 13 hours of sleep, so. And then I slept like another hour and a half before I had to go to work. 
so I slept from like 7.30 to 9, something like that. And this is all approximated. Um, only I end up with like about 14 hours of sleep, 14 and some change, something like that. Uh, so you know, that's always fun. My body's trying to play catch up on sleep, so I gotta take my ketamine, my medicine, which I need to take a uh, when I take it, I need to take a valerian root. Otherwise, like, it'll make me sleepy at first, but then it'll wake my ass up a little bit. But it's like that kind of like, I don't know. It's weird to explain. Like, I'll be really light. When I take it, I'm super lightheaded. But, oh yeah, I took like a little bite off of my weed gummy, so. But I usually will take a, like, two of these valerian root, too. Just to take any of that, like... I don't want to say anxiety, I just get like fidgety, I, I guess that's the best word to describe it, like, cause this is the one thing, okay so I already had bladder issues and like ketamine, it just, that's also why we reduced it, well I reduced it originally but then my doctor said well yeah the bio, the half life on that you can go every three days, so that's what I do. But when I was taking it every other day, it was messing with my bladder too much. And ketamine can do that. So, And I already have bladder issues, so the only time I have problems with it now is when I take it. And like a couple hours after I take it, like, I have to pee like every 10 minutes and it fucking sucks. And I hate my bladder. But it's also because I have to down like half a bottle of water because it tastes so gross. So it's like partially that and partially that the ketamine is messing with the bladder and it's just a known fact that ketamine will, can, and most often does mess with your bladder over time. So I try to reduce any negative effects, but I haven't really, it hasn't been an ongoing issue since we like scaled it. It's been over a year since I went to the every three days, so I'm rambling. I know some people get interested in like me taking ketamine for my depression and all that. I don't know if I ever need to do like an exclusive video on that or something. I haven't really talked about it like I mention it here and there, but I haven't really done like a you know focused video on that uh, since I started. <laughs> started and then I did like an update but I've been on it now for over two and a half years so it's been helping a lot okay so I'm gonna end this week's weekly -ish vlog for the first week of August so you can subscribe if you want because I post random shit <laughs>